Hello everyone, it's your boy KillerCow178 and welcome back for another Kung Fu Panda video. <laughs> So for today's video, we are going to be talking about the game Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends, the game. Yeah, the Kung Fu Panda game. Does anybody remember playing that game? Yes, I did make a gameplay video about it. It's not uploaded yet, but I'm going to edit the video right now because I just finished making the video of it. So you guys are going to have to stay tuned of when that video comes out. It, it's, it's not uploaded yet. I'm going to edit it just now. But, um, we're not going to review the game itself. I'm going to be talking about, uh, should the game actually get a sequel because of how good it is? Yes. Should Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends get a sequel? Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends 2. So, I do have some ideas of what could Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends 2 would look like. Or what, what could be uh, the objective of the game. And uh, what maps should we get, or playable characters should we get? So let's begin of my wish list of Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends 2. So, for maps, what maps should we have? Maybe we could have some maps just like from the first game. Like we, for example, I want maps like the Musician's Village. Uh, Cliff Road Bridge, uh, the Jade Palace Arena, um, but we could have new maps like that's different than than the same ones from the first game. Uh, we could have like um, the Hall of Heroes, or maybe uh, or maybe that uh, that one looking Spirit Realm from uh, Kung Fu Panda: The Dragon Knight. You know that one Spirit Realm, like like when they're on the when they're on. When they're on the platform and then and then when they just fall they they stay on the platform um maybe we could have that map because it could be more difficult like when you're fighting an opponent in the game and then if you just like feel like you're, you're going to fall off the map but you just stay back on and you're upside down and you're fighting upside down and just try your best of knocking out the opponent off the map and then uh, we could have uh, some other maps that are, are like in the Kung Fu Panda series. Like we could have um, oh that 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 uh, that like a map of like the the four constellations from Kung Fu Panda: Pause of Destiny. Maybe we could have maps like that about the four constellations, about the the four constellation statues, and uh, probably play in that map of like how it would would go. Like maybe we could just like. Like in like uh, this like room of the four constellations, and you're just fighting your opponents, and uh, yeah, that would just be a really good map. But uh, maybe we could have other that interesting maps that are that are, that are, that are cool and unique. But anyways, that's uh, all I gotta say about the maps that we should have. New maps, maybe we could bring back some old maps like the Jade Palace Arena, the Musicians Village, or um. Or the, the the jail cell from Tai Lung, and uh, we could have uh, I don't know like other types of maps should we have, but anyways I'm gonna leave that to you guys. What or what will your ideas be? But um, the next topic that will also say that Kung Fu Panda Showdown Legendary Legends 2 should have is new playable characters. So for example, number one, we should have Ping from Kung Fu Panda Legends of Awesomeness. Yes, he is the nephew of Tai Lung, so I think he would probably work as a playable character in Kung Fu Panda Showdown Legendary Legends 2. So, how would he work as a playable character? What would his awesome attack be? What would his special attack be? What what would his uh like attacks be like? Maybe it could be just like Tai Lung's, and we could have some same moves from Kung Fu Panda Legends of Awesomeness, like his same attacks, like 
like the leopard style attacks that we've seen in the show we could have we could bring back those types of of attacks when, 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 when the, like when we're controlling the player i'm sorry i cannot even talk right now but um uh, that's all i gotta say for about ping maybe his awesome attack would be uh like him using uh the neon gauntlet uh like for example like when you use your awesome attack um I could think that the control of that attack would be like you just like jump and just like press triangle and dive down at the opponent and just to knock them out. So that's all for Peng. Um, next up would be Zhen. I think Zhen would work as a playable character. Maybe Nuhai or Zheng, Bao, Fantong. Yes, like every character from the series. Maybe we could bring back Blade, um, Bao. New High, um, Zhao, and uh, I don't know. There's like so many like options, and it's endless. Maybe we should bring back some old playable characters, like from the first game, like Poe, Tigris, uh, Crane, uh, Kai, Tai Lung, Shen. Uh, we could have them in the game, but we could have some new playable characters, like Zhen from Kung Fu Panda 4, Blade from Kung Fu Panda the Dragon Knight, and like, like. Bao and Nuhai and Peng, like the possibilities are endless. And it's and it's up to you guys. Like, what should their attacks be? I want to hear your guys' ideas about what the attacks of like the characters from the series would be like in the second game of Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends 2. And the last uh, thing that I would probably say is that maybe we could have like the same music score from the series and the movies. Uh, for example, if we have a map of like uh, University where, where Cole and Jen were trying to go on a mission to stop the communion, and um, we could have that same music score of when we're fighting our opponents. And uh, I don't know, it's just like. I'm, I'm not much of a music theorist, and um, I'm not like a game designer or anything. I'm just wondering of what could the second game of Kung Fu Panda Showdown in Legends, Legends 2 would look like. But it would be awesome to have a sequel of the game, because, for example, Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, it was such a good game, and it got it didn't even got a sequel, so I've always wondered if Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends would get a sequel itself, Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends 2. So, that's all I gotta say for today's video, guys. I really think that Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends should get a sequel. Like, uh, it was such a good game. Like, yes, it's, like, the game is inspired off the Super Smash Bros. Because we know, like, we're finding off our favorite video game characters, like, in different maps and stuff. And you use the Super Smash to, like, uh, use it to, like, um, to, like, get rid of the opponents to, like, defeat your opponents off the game. And that's basically it. So, yeah, guys, thanks for watching for today's video. Um, if you guys liked it, be sure to like comment and also subscribe if you're new and if you're not new welcome back but yeah guys i want to hear your thoughts what should kung fu panda showdown of legendary legends 2 would look like what were your ideas about what should attack should the new playable characters be like uh, what awesome attack should they have what new maps should we get um what type of mechanic in the game should we get like a story mode challenge or the tournament challenge, like, I really like the tournament challenge. Uh, I didn't beat it um, when I played the game for the first time. I did make a gameplay video about it. So yeah, I'm going to upload that now. And I'm going to try to get this one uploaded now before I do uh, my uh, video of me playing a Kung Fu Panda Showdown Legends. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all next time. Skadoosh!